What are you thinking about? I told you I don't want to see you around me. Listen, girl. I am sorry about what happened, okay? Put the blame on me. Of course, all the blames are on you. You weren't who I thought you are, and you are not who everyone thinks you are. I know, Ruth. I am sorry. Your sorry can't solve anything. I am already damaged. <sighs> Ruth, can you just calm down? I mean, you are blowing everything out of proportion. Oh, really? Yeah. Are you being serious right now? Hey, goodness. See, girl, let me tell you something here. This life is all about enjoyment. Enjoyment, you say? Enjoy yourself before you die. Enjoyment, you say? I don't even know why I'm wasting my time talking to you. Rubbish. <laughs> Just this few men she slept with and she's acting up. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, my God, what was I going to say? Yes. Yes. What you heard here is not what it is. Then tell me what it is. I could not believe you'll be close to me all this while because you are sexually attracted to me. Yes, please. Don't make it sound like I'm a bad person. I just wanted to be friends with you. From being friends with you, you convinced me one day into sleeping with you. That's not true. Lisa, okay, okay. I am not interested in being a lesbian, neither being your friend. So if you don't mind, please excuse me. She's on that witch. Ruth, you asked me to wait for you at the gate. Don't you see your school mother? Why are you here? I guess she's busy, so I decided to sit here and wait. Really? Well, I came here because I saw your school mother leaving the school premises with her friend. So, were you really waiting for her? Or you are lying to me? She left. I guess she forgot I was waiting for her. Are you okay? Sure. Why? <laughs> because you seem different. Or should I say you're acting strange? It's nothing. I'm fine. Are you sure? Yes. Mom, I'm off to school, Mom. All right. Meanwhile, you have been studying with your classmates, and I hope this time you'll get a better result. I hope so too. <laughs> That is not what I want to hear. I want to hear you're going to do good, better than before. Because two head now is not joined together. So I want a better result. Do you hear me? More than before. More than the one you used to have. Okay? I will. Mean... Bye-bye. I trust in your blessing says she's coming. Um, don't worry, she'll be here soon. Hey, girls. Oh, yes, she is. How are you? I'm fine. Yeah, I got this. What should I do with it? It's yours. Mine? Mm -hmm. How? You know, sweetheart, you've been a very good daughter to me. So the best way to appreciate you is to get your phone. Really? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Listen now. Um, Keep being a good girl, okay? You will get anything you want. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so let's just um. Yeah, let's, let's go move. outside. Yeah. Blessing. Anderson, do you know you're a very stupid person? And listen to me very carefully. 
You will follow me to go and see the marriage counselor tomorrow. Rita, I am not going anywhere with you. It is you that have the problem. Go and see the marriage counselor. Anderson, we need to fix this family. You must follow me to go and see the marriage counselor. Oh, this marriage is over. Oh, let it be over. It better be over. And let me tell you, if I return to this house and see you in this house, what I'll do to you will not like it. If I set my eyes on you here again. Go! Foolish man. Mm. Come on, come on, move me now. Foolish man. Stupid. Don't want to come to this and see you again. Come on, move me. This man. What kind of man is this? Is that a phone you're holding? A phone? Where? There's no need to lie this time around. I saw it. Bring it out of the season in France. Mm -hmm. Give it to me. How? Where did you get this one from? Did you get it from? My dad didn't buy me before. My school mother did. She's no blessing. Why? What do you mean, why? You should ask my school mother. Mm, I wish she's your school mother. Well, shouldn't she be getting you stuff like school books, novels, tales book? Why a phone? Well, she chose buying me a phone. Why worry your head over it? Okay, fine. I go to tell parents about it. Hmm? As if they care. I told you my parents, all they do is to fight and quarry morning and night. But I think you should tell them. No! And that is final. Okay, okay, fine. And I don't know why it's not a blessing got you this phone. You understand, but you're my friend. I'm supposed to be happy for you, right? Of course, yes. Ruth, no! Ruth! <sighs> Guess who called today? Who? Mr. Anderson. And what did you tell him? Well, I told him we are not available. You know we have a VIP party to attend today, right? Well, Mr. Anderson is a very important person, so missing the VIP party won't be so bad now. What are you saying? You want to go see him? I'm saying I'll think about it. Well, that's in well, I don't know yet. That's in well. Oh, let me get this. Oh, they want you to have this. You better think well. Mm -hmm. What? Please, mm -hmm. man, get one for yourself. Have it. I can't. I can't reach it now. Oh, I'm sure you want to laugh sorry. now. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, um, Ruth, we have VIP party to attend tonight. Okay. You will not be able to go. Why? Because I want you to handle something else while we are away. What is it? I'll let you know. Yeah. Listen, relax, okay? Yeah. See, this is my client. He is my number one. I mean, I don't joke with him. Okay? So treat him with care. I mean, touch his. Maple, you know, mm -hmm. massage he, you understand? Must especially make him forget his wife. I will do that. <laughs> <laughs> I know you will do that. I know what you're capable of doing. I will do that. Uh -huh. <laughs> you will like, ah. Uh. You know what's all right? I don't need to explain anything to you. No. Yeah. Okay, so I will just give you some time to relax yourself before he comes in, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Good, yeah. Dad! 
Let's go and see the marriage counselor. I know I was planning this marriage. I am not ready to go anywhere which I'm not interested. You can go. You have to be interested though. Seriously. This is a serious matter. Rita, are you even a mother? If you look around, you can see that you have more issues at hand. Understand. What is more important than we going to see the counselor? Anderson, please talk to me. Anderson, talk to me now. Are you walking away? What kind of man is this? of course. Since you spilled the milk all over the place, she's no longer talking to me again. Oh wow, that is good news. You know, it's high time we resolved our issues and let love lead. Let's fix our relationship. There is nothing to fix. I'm tired of you and this relationship is over between us. No, it's not. It is. Remember I cut the shot. Lisa! Lisa, please! Lisa! I cannot tell this girl to come meet you. That would be wicked of me. Bless him. I don't understand what you're talking about. I already paid you. So it is either Ruth or no one else. Yes. Do you even know what happened to this girl? She is broken. In fact, she doesn't even want to see me. She does not want to see me. And come to think of it, you have slept with her twice. So I'll get you another girl I just met in SS1 class. Blah, blah, blah. Don't you get it? Blessing, it is either you provide me a roof or yourself. So the choice is yours to make. Listen, listen, listen to me. Listen to me. I've said this before and I'm going to repeat myself again. We are not on the same level. You are not my class. Molly, you can never have me. It's either you take it the way it is or I refund you your money. Okay, fine. You can't see me, John Cena, right? Well, make sure you make... <laughs> Molly can't see you, right? But try and make sure that Ruth is available when next I'll be needing her. 
If they tell me, say, I know be your level. That is to say, Molly can't see you. Ta. Kain, Kain. Ruth, have you been sleeping with Molly? Shh. What are you talking about? What am I talking about? I knew there was something wrong with you. I knew there is something going on. You've been acting strange. Okay, fine. Tell me what I need to know. What else did she make you do? Really? Is that the answer? Okay. Fine. What else did she make you do? Talk to me. Okay, can we go somewhere quiet and talk? Please. Let's go. Please sit. I don't want to sit. I want to know how my best friend, my best friend, went from being a well brought up girl to a girl who goes around satisfying guys' sexual urge. Please don't say it that way. How else do you want me to say it? I never wanted to do this. I asked in your blessing to be my school mother. Instead of her teaching me, she taught me that the only way to enjoy life is by sleeping with men and making money. Huh? Wait. Are you trying to tell me that you've been sleeping with other guys too? Yes. But last night was a different scenario. My mom had been telling me about my dad's cheating habits, but I never took it serious. How? My dad was the client's blessing that Janet arranged for me. What? Your dad? That blessing needs to be arrested. Wait, is your mother aware of this? No. My dad said... Your dad what? This isn't about your dad. It's about you. Come on, Ruth. It's about your dad. It's about you. I thought following Sino Blessing's full step would give me the happiness my parents never gave me. But here yeah, I am, disappointed and unhappy at myself. Truth. I understand. But first thing first, you would have confided in me as your best friend. Then, secondly, we need to report this to the school authority. Last but not the least, come on, you tell your parents about it. No, I don't want to blow things out of proportion. I just want to act as if nothing happened. Because if my mom gets to hear this, my house will be on fire. And I don't want that. It's all right, Shoot. I understand. But henceforth, you will stay away from blessing, okay? Come on. Sorry. So sorry, okay? Hmm? Sorry. Rejoice. Are you still not going to talk to me? Rejoice, I'm talking to what? you. What? Sorry. I'm a lesbian too. So. What? Yes. I broke up with my partner. Then let's be partner then. You're not my type. Lisa. She's on this. What? I'm not her type. As beautiful as I am. Chisom. What did she say in Chisom? Okay. Lisa, why are you here? Is this it? Girl, you are a snitch. I comforted with Joyce and she told me that she's a lesbian too. She also told me that you are her type. <laughs> Lisa, is that why you are here? I'm here to sound this as a warning to you. If Joyce approach you, turn her down. Why? I won't. I can't. Lisa, I will never. Moreover, with Joyce and I are already working things out. She's so can do this to me. I'm already doing it, my love. With Joyce and I will soon be together. She broke up with me, have you forgotten? Hmm? Let's talk things out. There is nothing to talk about, you miserable maggot. I am filing for a divorce and there is nothing you can do about it. Go ahead and fight for a divorce. Wait, do I look like I'm begging you? Just let man who does not know his worth as a man fight for divorce. Do I care? I think I have had enough of this nonsense. And if you 
they open your mouth and you suck it one more time. I will forget that you are a woman and use my hands and do the needful on you. You are a liar. That is a lie. Anderson Ojofo, I dare you. Touch me. Touch me. I will teach you the lesson of the lie. Enough, both of you. Every day fighting and quarreling. Look at how everyone is hearing your voices outside. Are you not both ashamed of yourselves? When does you do even sit your daughter down and talk to her? Because both of you don't care. All you both do is quarry, fight, and render abuses on each other. If you both are tired of each other, separate, separate, and have peace of mind. From a cheating father to a nagging mother, from a nagging mother to a useless daughter, what a perfect family! <laughs> Dad, wait. Where are you going to? As you can see, I'm about going out. Dad, what do you think you are doing? Your home is at the verge of tearing apart and all you could think right now is going out. You saw your own daughter in a hotel room where you are supposed to meet up with one of your sex toys and you couldn't do anything about it. You couldn't do anything about the girls who introduced your own daughter to sex slavery. Dad, why? Simply because you have sold yourself so cheaply to them that you cannot stand them. Dad, I want to ask, do you ever love me? Yes, I love you. No, I don't think so. If you have ever loved me, I think you would have followed this matter up. No problem. Maybe you don't want to be seen as a bad father. I promise you, Dad, if you don't bring back peace to this family, I will leave and never return. What are you thinking about? I told you I don't want to see you around me. Listen, girl, I am sorry about what happened, okay? Put the blame on me. Of course, all the blames are on you. You weren't who I thought you are, and you are not who everyone thinks you are. I know, Ruth. I am sorry. Your sorry can't solve anything. I am already damaged. <sighs> Ruth, can you just calm down? I mean, you are blowing everything out of proportion. Oh, really? Yeah. Are you being serious right now? Hey, goodness. See, girl, let me tell you something here. This life is all about enjoyment. Enjoyment, you say? Enjoy yourself before you die. Enjoyment, you say? I don't even know why I'm wasting my time talking to you. Rubbish. <laughs> Just this few men she slept and she's acting up. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, my girl, what was I going to say? Okay. She's very wicked. She's, She's not even remorseful at all. Let me guess. It's in your blessing. Come on, Ruth. Everything is not your fault. Okay? It is. I was so foolish. <sighs> you need to calm down. What to report to the school authorities. So much to think with for victim. No. I don't want this to be out. I just want to add like nothing happened. But something happened. Anyway. This is the class. Sorry. Good afternoon, ma'am. Good afternoon, Deborah. How are you? I'm fine, ma'am. How may I help you? I'm um, here to talk to you about something. Hope all is well. Um, yes, ma'am. Okay, I'm all yours. Lisa, darling, why are you here all alone? Oh, sorry, my bad. I just forgot you don't have a girlfriend. Mm. Lisa, yes. Lisa, Lisa, baby, you were too greedy. I swear. Eh? So you wanted to have me and rejoice all to yourself. What happened at the end now? You lost the both of us. Eh? Will the both of you get out of my sight right now? Eh? Of course! 